What it do, everyday people, man? It's your boy PJ. Today we back with another lit video. We back in the confessional, and yeah, we staying lit, big dog, man. Shout out to my everyday people who rock with me every day. Shout out to my boy Lucky Wizard. Did you check out his YouTube channel? All right, man. Let's get into it. You know I got the custom freaks, cups, Dallas Cowboys. You know we got that super fat burner. Okay, y'all know links in the bio description below I check those out hey man Charleston white Charleston white he got some strong words for Diddy and Cassie but I want y'all I want y'all to let me know in the comment section what do y'all think do y'all value Charleston white's opinion Charleston white is very opinionated about a lot of stuff and he has a strong opinion about a lot of stuff he knows what he means and means what he says now a lot of times he just be capping for the internet uh, like he was capping on a uh, big extra plug but a lot of people like big extra plug or kevin gates they understand this man just gave me a shout out i made it when charleston white say your name you made it you officially made it because then people gonna search you when, when, when he talks about Big Ass The Plug, man, he, he started trending on Twitter. So, it was a plug. So, shout out to Charleston White for that. But anyway, let's get into it. I was rocking with Cassie. Till I realized, this shit wants some money. I keep telling y'all, boy, I hope you want some money. <laughs> so, you talking about, you down there, you can fuck, you can fuck their cousin. You can come back and let their daughter grow up, try to fuck their daughter. You can kill their brother. You can whoop their daddy. Them hoes, if, if you got some money, uh, you can do all that. Yeah, yeah, you can. They, they, they go to show you. If you got money, you can rape a bitch. Did it, did. If you got money, you can whoop a bitch. Did it, did. If you got money, you can sex traffic a bitch. Did it, did. If you got money, you can blow up a bitch boyfriend car. Did it, did. It ain't nobody mad at did it. Ain't nobody mad that did it. Now, here it is. I came to the internet. I played like I was a rapist. I played like I done rape white girls and white women. And I've been saying, oh, I rape white women. And they were saying, oh, he a rapist. Oh, he shouldn't say he raping. And I keep telling y'all, T.I. been accused of rape. Kobe Bryant. Tupac. Lawrence Taylor. Puffy Combs. These boys is serial rapists. <laughs> And they like to go get young girl. Jay-Z did it. Jay-Z got Foxy Brown when she was 15, 16. Jay-Z started putting that harsh dick in Beyonce when she was 17, 18. A uh, Dame Dash got a little. So it's a thing for these niggas with pedophilia. They like young girl. They like young girl. They like getting them young girl peeing on them. Like you putting them pills in their mouth and going to get male prostitutes. Now think about this. This girl said... The boy was going to go hire male prostitutes. Male prostitute fucking her. And he over in the corner trying to crank up the line more. I don't know. Think about what the girl said, y'all. Y'all think about it. Think about what the little girl said. The little girl said the boy was going to go get male prostitutes. And why? The male prostitute i be taking her through Pound Town. They, they putting the Pound down, game down on her. Diddy is in the corner with his Sean John robe on, trying to start the line more. <laughs> He's trying to crank up, and she over there getting ground pound. Next thing you know, yeah, 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 yeah. He got the boys putting the pound town down, and he trying to take the men to the liquor store. <laughs> I say, think about that. This is why I don't want a billion dollars. Just Buffy is the first nigga to get a billion. Now, think I told y'all, once you get so much money, you can't have regular sex no more. Nigga, you done fucked two <laughs> You done got a billion dollars at one time. Nigga, you fucking like you got an octopus dick. Yeah, you fucking like your dick got octopus on. You got toes everywhere touching your dick, sucking your dick. And you only got one dick with all these multiple women. 
What ends up happening is they find other areas to stimulate. Well, one, only two of them can get on that dick. <laughs> one hole playing in your ear, one hole thumping you in the back of the head, another hole finding other areas to stimulate. And that's what didn't happen to Puffy. So he, <laughs> so listen, he going to go get the, <laughs> I can't thank y'all. Hey, he going to go get the male prostitutes to, they go bring the pound, ground pound town game down on Cassie. And he go bring the liquor store. He licking nuts and ass and he sucking dick. He the liquor store, she the pound down. Hey, that was a hell of a team there, boy. That was a Bunny and Clyde duo. <laughs> I'm not bullshit. That was a hell of a Bunny and Clyde duo. And they lasted a long time. So I don't want to hear nothing about no bitch coming back like them hoes did from the 70s. Talking about a nigga slipped the pill in they motherfucking me drank and put an X pill in they booty while he was fucking her from behind. Bitch, that's the way now. That's Fred called that uh, 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 recreational sex. Bitch, stop playing. Y'all lying on... Yeah, 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 I'm trying to thank everybody lying. They lying on Bill. They ain't lying on Diddy. What's up, young brother? Charles. What's up, man? Young nigga with a backpack in his hands in his pocket. I feel to run around to the front. Get <laughs> scared shit out of here. Get your head out of the pocket, y'all, brother. <laughs> now, they've been together forever. Did it and Cassie have been together forever. Now, all of a sudden, I told y'all, nigga can do what he want to with his bitch if he got some money. It's only the broke nigga can't slap his hoe. I'm telling you, it's only the nigga with a job like James Devins uh, and got the pressures of the world uh, on him like Lamont Sample. Y'all, it might be too young. I'm going to say it's only the, the nigga like, that got job like James Devin uh, and got the pressures of the world uh, on him like Lamont Sample. Y'all, it might be too young. I'm going to say it's only the, the nigga like, that got job like James Devin and got the pressure on the world like Lamont Sample. Not Fred, but Lamont. Boy, I'm going to go get them motherfucking male. I can't stop that. Boy, go go get them male prostitutes and let them boy put that motherfucking pound. Yeah, take the girl down to pound town. And he's sitting over in the corner trying to line more. Yeah. <laughs> then next day, you know, he want to take everybody to the liquor store. Yeah, yeah, the, yeah. He done went and got the men to do the ground pounding game. And he over in the corner trying to get everybody to come to the liquor store. He licking on shit. I, I knew I ain't like Diddy. I always been a Tupac fan. I always been a Tupac fan. <laughs> <laughs> ah, man. Charleston White is a fool, big dog. I don't know, man. Like I said, with her smoke this far, I think a lot of people... People can say what they want, give their opinion on this situation. There's a lot of truth to all the BS. That every, like what Slim Thug was saying, it's a lot of truth to it. What Charleston White saying, it's a lot of truth to it. I mean, but that see, the thing is, we don't like to hear the truth. We like to stimulate our minds and make whatever makes us feel good. So a lot of us avoid the truth. You know, but not saying that it's... Their truth is whoever's truth it pertains to because a lot of this stuff happens and we sweep it all under the rug and act like, you know, oh, well, it's not like that. Well, a lot of times it is and we got to stop sweeping that stuff under the rug. Some of y'all need to have better conversations with your peoples so y'all can, you know, so we can do better. We, we got to do better. OK, we got to do better. All right, well, everyday people, man, let me know what y'all think about Charleston White in the comment section. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to holler at you later. Peace.